Hello. Hi. Um, back with the baby book, just to show you a few other things. Um, we're still working as well in school, so that's why it's taking a little bit to get back to you. I apologize. So what we have here is we have the... Um, so here's the first page. I think I maybe showed you that before. That was a paragraph of the information. Okay. And this is an example from last year. Um, and then we have this. And I noticed some of you have that on already on your um, uh, assignment already done that you're showing me that you have this page done. And the next page is the birth certificate. Okay. And you could make your own if you really want to. This person should have shaded, you know, put some color here. Each of these pages should have color. Um, she did a little shading here, this color here, but that looks not too bad. Uh, here's another page. Uh, this is the picture, um, page four, I believe. The one where you put the head has um, the number of the atomic number and then the different parts of the body. So if it was 10, the main body would have 10 parts or so on. Um, it all depends upon your element, right? And so that's that one right there. And then we have the poem. And the poem doesn't have to be anything fancy. But it should have about eight lines. Okay. We, uh, by the way, we are still working on this at, in class. So that's why um, it's still it's taking a little time for everything. But just the way it is. Um, and here is the family. So then you take your element and you find two members of the same uh, family on the periodic table. So if you had, um, well, if you had helium or if you had neon like this one, if you look on a colored periodic table from the internet, you will see that all, everything that is categorized by color. If yours is colored yellow, there's going to be other uh, elements with that same color. Those are from the same family. All you need to do is take two of those and put it on a page like this in order to get the um to get it done and here you can even see down on the bottom we have the address so it says second street ramsey avenue what that's from is that this particular one was neon it's in the second period on the periodic table and so the address for this made up uh, baby would be second street Ramsey Avenue. Ramsey is the um, discoverer for this particular element. So that's why it is the way it is. Okay. All right. Here is the Bohr model for, you know, one of the pages um, is the Bohr model. I believe page six. So this one should have had more color. Otherwise, looking good. And then we have um, this one here is the career. Okay, so you find out what your element is used for. And then just like a baby who will grow up to be something, your element will grow up to be something. This happens to be neon. So here she has neon lights is what she's she's showing here and that is the very last page okay that's page eight so this must be page seven and six and so on okay look through this more than once if you need to ask some questions if you need to um and we'll get through this okay many of you have picked up your material um for the instruction of this in the uh, office of the school, um, along with the other project that we have. So 
good job. Otherwise, uh, pick those up and get this done. All right, it's Friday today, so I'm closing the book, and I hope you have a great weekend. Let me know if you need help.